This book really helped me look at aging and dying in a new light. So in that way, I would really, really recommend this for people who, if you're going through a death in the family and it's really shocking you and you're thinking about what is the meaning of life, what is the meaning of death, this is a very good book to help you through that. And also, if you're somebody who's going through your own aging process and it's difficult for you to digest or look at it positively, this book will also help you with that as well. Hi guys, this is Linda from Brain Education TV. If this is your first time, welcome! Make sure you like this video, subscribe to our channel, and click the bell for notifications of each new episode. In this video, I'm going to be talking about longevity. Have you thought about living to 120 years old? If you've been following our channel and if you follow the works of Il Chili, the founder of Brain Education, this idea is not new to you. But those of you who are new to this channel, have not been really familiar with Il Chili's teachings, have you ever thought about your life right now living to be 120 years old. Some people, that idea might be very exciting, while for other people, that thought might be so, so dreadful. So which one of these are you? I know when I first thought about this idea, me living to 120 years old, that sounds like a very, very long time. And I also remember thinking, I don't think that's possible. And then I dug a little deeper and I found out that actually human beings, our bodies were designed to live up to 120 years old, depending on how well we take care of ourselves. So to tackle this idea of longevity, Il Chili published this book, I've decided to live 120 years in 2017. The idea of writing this book came to him when he himself witnessed the process of aging in his own body. And also after witnessing the death of his beloved father, whom he was very close with, he really started to question this idea of aging and also dying. And he thought, Aging and death are inevitable components of our life. So if there are things that cannot be avoided, then why not try to age well and die well? So when this book first came out in 2017 and this idea of living to 120 years first came out, it was a radical, radical thought. Something that most people have never even thought of before, including myself. But since its release, this thought-provoking book has been loved by readers around the world and has been an absolute must-read iconic book about longevity and healthy aging. And to help more people get access to the valuable information in this book, the book has been translated into 11 languages so far, and the 12th language is about to be released very soon. You can read the I've Decided to Live 120 Years book by Il Chili in English, Italian, Russian, Lithuanian, Simplified Chinese, Traditional Chinese, Korean, Japanese, Danish, Spanish, Hindi, and Telugu. I would say my favorite part about the 120 book is that it really challenges you to rethink what life really means. Because normal people wouldn't think that we could live up to 120 years, but based on scientific research, we can. And actually now they're finding out there's so much advancement in technology and medicine that human beings can actually live up to 150 years as our maximum potential. And when this book first came out, that idea seemed so radical and crazy, but now it doesn't seem that far reaching anymore. So in this book, Il Chili details different exercises and ideas ideas that you can do and adapt into your life to create a healthy lifestyle physically, emotionally, and mentally to maximize the chance of us living to our fullest and greatest potential. And a big part of living that long, fulfilling life is shifting our value, our core value from seeking only money and success and material goods and transforming that to seeking a spiritual life that is based on growing your soul, giving back to the community and doing things that enrich you from within. So this book really helped me look at aging and dying in a new light. So in that way, I would really really recommend this for people who if you're going through a death in the family and it's really shocking you and you're thinking about what is the meaning of life what is the meaning of death this is a very good book to help you through that and also if you're somebody who's going through your own aging process and it's difficult for you to digest or look at it positively this book will also help you with that as well. So the contents of this book have been so transformational and so great that they've actually been turned into retreat programs and workshops so that people can experience, learn about, and adapt 
a healthy lifestyle for 120 years. So if you're also very curious and interested about learning the contents about aging and dying well, check out this book on Amazon. I'll drop a link in the description below how you can get your own copy as well. From this book, you can develop new insights and thoughts about how to approach the later half of your life to be more fulfilling, rewarding, healthy, and happy. I hope all of you watching this video have a chance to read this book. I'll see you next time. Bye.